Hi, my name is Akshay Zoshi and in this short video, I am going to demonstrate the search object functionality in pgAdmin 4. This feature was introduced in pgAdmin 4 version 4.21. With this feature, you can search for any kind of object in the database. You can access it by right clicking a database or any of its child nodes and select search objects from the context menu. You can also access it by hitting the shortcut Alt plus Shift plus S or Option plus Shift plus S depending on the platform. The minimum pattern length is 3 characters. The search performed is a non-case sensitive and will find all object whose name contains the pattern. You can only search for object names currently. Examples are ABC, percent %AB, percent %AB percent %C, percent 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 and some more combination like this. Let's see how it works. Connect to the database server PostgreSQL 14 and select the Postgres database. Open the search object dialog from the context menu or by hitting the shortcut option plus shift plus s. I have already created a few tables. One of them is the expenses table. Let's type three characters like ex percent and hit either enter key or click on the search button. The result is presented in the grid with the object name, object type and the object tree path in the browser. You can double click on a result row to locate the object in the browser tree. Double click on the expenses table and it gets selected in the browser tree. See expenses table gets selected. Now double click on the expenses underscore p key primary key. It gets selected in the browser tree. As you can see there is a function named example with an ellipsis. You can click on the ellipsis to expand the function name and see the function arguments. You can also filter based on a particular object type by selecting one from the object type drop down. If the search button is hit when one of the object type is selected then only those types will be considered for the search. Let's select the primary key from the drop down and click on the search button. You will only see the primary key expenses underscore p key in the list. An object node type can be marked as a hidden in the browser tree using preferences. I have marked the partition nodes to be hidden. I have also created a partition table with some partitions. Now let's try to search for the partition table. Open the search dialog and type MEA. percent percent and hit the enter key or click on the search button. It will list all the partitions and partition tables. As you can see a few objects are grayed out. This means that you have not enabled those object types in the preferences. So the objects cannot be located on the browser tree. If you double click on a grayed out objects then it will show the error message as partition objects are disabled in the browser. You can enable them in the preferences dialog. Let's see by clicking on the this link. It opens the preferences dialog where you can enable the node. So here it is partition which I have already disabled. An object type will not be visible in the drop down if the database server does not support it or if it is not enabled from the preferences. Let's see partitions is not visible in the drop down here. With the help of search objects one can find any object in the database and locate them easily. Thank you for watching the demo. I hope you like the feature and will find it useful.